The Sunshine Coast has failed to break the record for the largest Marco Polo competition, but it didn't stop locals giving it a strong go. Competitors were more than willing to play dirty to take home the glory. A backyard game that just got serious. Marco! Vying for the unofficial title of the largest tournament in the region, dozens turned out for a chance at glory. On hand, a host of coast celebrities playing the role of Marco, Iron Man and Iron Woman, Darren and Jordan Mercer. <laughs> Referee keeping everyone in line, Iron Man legend Grant Kenny. <laughs> Age was no limit, it was on for young and old, many reverting back to their childhoods, remembering tactics that served them well. Yeah, there was, I have to say, there was a little bit of dishonesty going on. There were some people sliding under the barrier, going out of bounds, and we had some other people not responding with polo when they should have, which was, you know, which is not in the spirit of the game. And one by one, the numbers dwindled. To up the odds, they added another Marco, but it didn't deter these two. Come on! Unbelievable! <laughs> The boys' team effort winning them gold and a $1,000 prize. It's a tough game. I think that should be an elite sport. It's a tough game, Marco Polo. I think we're going to come back next year and we'll have a crack at murder in the dark. Lauren Ritchie, Win News.